With popular 4th of July events canceled this year, firework tents are seeing lots of customers planning for their own show at home. Yeah, the surge of sales is especially beneficial for the stands where the proceeds benefit nonprofit organizations. KETV Newswatch, Newswatch 7's Emily Tenser has more. Six-year-old Bradley King scans the shelves. He's searching for the perfect firework for his 4th of July. The fireworks may pop. His family chose the tent at 72nd and military, knowing part of the proceeds went to a nonprofit organization. It's more important to my sister. She just wanted to be sure where the money was going, basically. Richard Webb is the executive director of the organization 100 Black Men of Omaha. He says fireworks sales benefiting nonprofits are especially important this year. It helps us to continuously look at different ways of alternatives that we can support our mentees still, support our mentors still, because social, uh, social and emotional uh, tolls right now are being taken on our mentees from not just the pandemic, but from everything else that's going on in the world. At 144th and Maple, some of the sales at the AK fireworks stand go to the Sienna Francis house. A month ago, we wondered if we were going to be able to have tents open. So uh, we were sitting on a lot of fireworks wondering what's going to happen. Well, it worked out well. With popular firework events canceled this year, Kelly Keegan says families are resorting to hosting their own at-home show. I think there's a lot of pent-up frustration. People want to get out and do things. Shoppers say this 4th of July will be different but special. It's going to have more meaning. Why is that? Just because of everything that's gone on with the start of the year. And Bradley's family plans to use the holiday as a fun distraction. Everybody enjoy your holiday and take one day off, uh, not think about COVID, <laughs> but still be safe. A majority of fireworks stands are back open again tomorrow at 8 a.m. and a majority of their profits rely on 4th of July sales. Reporting in Omaha, Emily Tensor, KETV Newswatch 7.